So if you had to pick between uh, Lado or Crudip, um, all things being considered, one slam dunk person to play the part of Pre, uh, who, who would you pick? Ty? Uh, Jared Leto walked around with a mirror in his back pocket on set. Well, the story, <laughs> the stories I heard about uh, Billy Crudup on set with the other runners and uh, other people, like Billy Crudup. <laughs> yeah, we were doing the scene, we were doing the workout scene at the golf course. And I had driven up there, like I said, from San Francisco with my car and I had my golf clubs in the trunk. So I drive out to set that day. They're doing a thing with Jimmy Ho is running around circles and they called him over about, about Prefontaine sticking his butt out in that whole scene, right? Where they're doing intervals yep. in the grass. But between takes, like you say, there's hours and hours and hours and hours. So I pull out the golf clubs out of the back of my car and I'm like, hey, what the hell? Let's just hit a few, right? Because the, the camera is like 200 yards in a different direction. There's nobody there. They got the whole thing rented out. We're like, hell yeah, right? So a couple of runners are stepping up, right? We're hitting a few under this, this par five long thing, right? Crude up walks over. You know, I told you he was an athlete. He was, he was, a, he was a wrestler in high school, right? Pulls the driver out. No one's messing with the driver because no one can hit the driver, right? He pulls the driver out and he rips one, one straight down the flipping middle. Had to be 300 yards. Hands the club back, walks away. Didn't say a freaking word. <laughs> <laughs> He could hit a golf ball. I'll tell you that. It was awesome. That yeah, he was super athletic. And like I said, yeah, I go Crudup. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Jared Leto just because I think he's a better actor. And if anybody, if you haven't seen his performance in Dallas Buyers Club, um, I strongly suggest you go see that. That was well. Hey, he got skinny arms for that movie. Incredible. Yeah, you're right. He was. He, <laughs> it was amazing. That was. He was unbelievable in that. I. Yeah. And, I was and, hoping. I was what about that? Uh, say that. And, and, and McConaughey was in there, too. See, my two guys. That would have been good. No, uh, is he in Requiem for a Dream, too? I would, yes. have, had, I would have had Lato play Pat Tyson. <laughs> no, but Lato, you guys, Lato Requiem for a Dream is awesome.